Welcome back to Link's Awakening. Ah, oh, crap, a bomb. Oh, I hope you don't need bombs We've... for the rest of the game. We've forged our way to... I don't know what this is. There's a big old waterfall somewhere right up here. And we're going to go in and we're going to have a good time. Well, you're about to find out the name. You literally walk in and it's like, this is the dungeon. Angler's Tunnel. With the world's easiest boss ever. Oh, boy. Oh, I think I know what this boss is. Yeah, to, to come flashing back and was like, oh, he was that easy. Oh, uh, do I have... Flip oh, I have a shield. Yes, you have a shield. Constantly. You don't have to change it over as an item anymore. I was looking at those guys thinking, like, I gotta have something to... Okay, that's deep. You don't have to flip her shit. You dip her. Dip her pine. Well, I was looking at that thinking, okay, well, maybe it's like a different... Because I was just looking at it out of the corner of my eye. It looked like a different colored tile or something. Yeah, like the shadow there makes it look like it's a little deeper on one side, so you may be able just to walk across, but it's like, nope, you still drown. It's all the same. I want to break those pots, but I don't think it's going to be an easy thing to do. Nope. I mean, you can probably run over there. So yeah, think. but then they gotta worry about getting back. Good job, guy. Now to throw magic dust on this electrical fire. It made it, it got work. a compass. Man, look at all those chests. And there's one down here. I went on a weird little tangent within my own mind, but did you ever like those combo snack things? Oh, I eat, I used to eat them so friggin' much. I never cared for those. They just did not taste good to me. I haven't had them in a long time. I, I just... I, I went on a thing. I was gonna make like a... Uh, I was gonna make a joke about the compass, and it was like the more like the combo of man, man. And then I was like, and I thought of combos, and I was like, I, you know, I wanted to like those, but something about them just did not taste good to me at all. At all. There were different flavors, and I know a lot of flavors I did not like at all. But I found one, and it's been so long since I've eaten them that I forget which one that was. But I remember there was one that w was like, man, that's the stuff right there. Mm. The rest of y'all are weird, but that one, mmm. I like the same thing with the goldfish. I can never really get behind goldfish. While other people were like, yeah, goldfish. I was like, I don't know, man. Maybe. I think it's the cheese thing. There's probably something like a little too much processed cheese kind of gets me. Mmm. And we even have the minus. Look at that map. Oh, so one thing I thought was funny and I didn't notice it until I looked back through the previous videos was that the bottle dungeon was shaped like a bottle. Oh, yeah. And that's that's so cute. I mean, you kind of see this one dressed as a trident, but that's... Yeah, I can kind of see that. I mean, that's kind of a stretch for the angler's tunnel. Angler's Tunnel? Okay, so... I have one key. Which isn't gonna get me very far down there. But here, I can... Right, it's on a button. And I don't know what button. The left Is it button. that button? Is it that button? The left button. Is it that button? Oh. Is it that button? It's that button. The left one? Not even close. Or is it the right one? I can't remember. Le oh, come on, I had that. Left one is dash. Okay. There we go. Like that. Is that a pea hat? Crap! In Zelda? That's just craziness. It worked! Somehow. Really? That counted? 
It sounds so sad when he drowns. Okay, so I think this is the first time that we've actually recorded since, like, videos were uploaded. And there were a couple people that mentioned they didn't like this particular remake. And... Or specifically, they didn't like the art style of it. And while A, I love the art style, B, it does give a very different feel from the original game, which was almost a little... I want to say, like, a little gritty, a little foreboding. It just didn't like the art direction. And in this game, you don't have that. Nice. Like, the art direction is a lot more cheerful. So I can kind of understand that. I still love this art style, but I can kind of understand that complaint. Nope. Okay, so now what do we do? I have three keys. Ah, and three keys is enough to get me there. So I just have to go all the way back to the start. I feel like that would have been a really good time for a mini-boss. I'm pretty sure you're going to come up with one soon enough. I'm just thinking just to save time so I'm not going... These dungeons aren't that long feeling when, you know, a lot of the screens are connected. Oh, I think another thing that I wanted to mention was I did mention a couple grievances last time just about conveyance here and there, but, like, that's just a couple of small things at the end of the day. I have been enjoying the heck out of this, and I've really been looking forward to playing it. I mean, I love it. Like, I want to keep my playthrough kind of blind. But you're kind of getting that whole, like, I, I kind of want to play through or a little bit more to see where I can go. Yeah, but like, I, I don't know. I just kind of want to keep playing. I want to go in the next dungeon. Is that an eye or lips? Where? On the front of these things. The statues? Their eyes. These. Oh, these? The water striders. Lips. These big old kissy lips. Yeah. I don't like this dungeon anymore. I'm not getting to that. No. I think even with the Pegasus boots, you can't make it. Well, mm -mm. No. nah, three blocks max. Yeah, they specifically have it to where it's like three blocks max. I was off center. Oh yeah, y'all over there, I'm only gonna know what hit you. Especially that guy with the shield who's like trying to stab me through here. Come on, dude. Yeah, I would go left. Can I go in there? Maybe. Depends how many of these I can push. No, nah, I think that's the only one you can push. Only thing that ever bothered me about Zelda games are you never know what you can push and what you can't. My key! Oh, your key landed on me. Oh, I landed on my keys! I think it's the one joke from that cartoon that I'll always remember, no matter what. Yeah, like, at the end of the day... Alright, later, dude. <laughs> that wasn't even that deep! Yeah, like, at the end of the day, it was, like, an alright show. But that one joke... <laughs> you wanna come over here? Why do they call them pea hats? I don't know. Such a weird name. You're on the water, good sir. 
Okay, so I can make that jump, but I can't get to the front of the chest. And as we know, chests are impossible to open from any other direction but the front. Awkward as that may be. So I can get there, but I don't think I can do anything, even if I did get over there. Key block in the way. Dang it. I'm glad that only does half a heart damage, because that's rude. I looked away for like a second, and I just heard you say, dang it, and I thought, oh, was it just because of the key? And I was like, nope, you just drowned again. These guys literally have the best energy of like, I'm gonna stab ya! I'm gonna stab ya! I'm gonna get ya! I'm gonna get ya! Rude. I should be able to kill a pea hat with this when they're flying around. Is that just the damage value thing? Like, it, it has to be for, like, well, the reason the pots can just end something. I don't know. I feel like... I know in Link to the Past they did, I'm pretty sure, Tempered Sword level damage. Yeah, you mentioned that. Which is, like, stupid powerful. Yeah, especially early on. But I guess they... It was hard... Perhaps it was hard to make... I guess it was maybe hard to have, like, different pots with different damage values. Well, I just can't do this next, because number two is way in the corner. Yeah, I'm just not gonna bother. I'll get back to that. So maybe it was hard to, like, make different pots have different damage values or something, and they wanted to make sure pots were still, like, kind of reasonable, even at endgame. That's my guess. I mean, I wouldn't make pots have a different damage value. That's too much variability in everything. Variability? What the hell am I saying? Too many variables in the whole thing. Yeah. Ah! I'm gonna wait, because he dies and maybe an item drops. Yeah, right on top, you push shoot. They look so wiggly! I feel so bad for them. Those... They remind me of the okay, bits so... and the bots from Link's Adventure? It's Zelda 2, right? Link's Adventure? E the Adventures of Link? The Adventures of Link. Maybe? I don't know. Yeah, it's the Adventures of Link. Uh, they remind me of those from that. I, did they, like, show up in any of their Zelda nice. games beforehand? Can you at least give me the rupee? Like, the only other Zelda game they probably could have showed up in was, like, Link to the Past. And I don't really recall little slime balls over there. I think you can jump that. I can, but if I do, I'm going to jump right in. There we go. But I can't do anything once I'm here. Nah, uh, yeah, you don't have space for that. Well, guess we're going to have to go somewhere else now. Man, and I can't get to that, and that's how you get up there. I was thinking that's where... Oh, there's another key door up here. I was looking at that key block going, that's what I gotta do! I mean, that or no, the there's another key door. Probably the key door would be best. Yeah, because is there a... Because I can't really... No, I can go back and get to that. No, you want to do this first. Mini boss time. Yeah, Fucker. okay, yeah. I always hated this one. I don't feel like I could ever figure him out. Because if you remember Ocarina of Time, it's just basically ah. that octopus boss where you have to get behind him and smack him in the butt with your sword. Is that a bow and arrow? No, you don't. Is that a boomerang? No, you don't. I didn't even know that, Ogre. I know that because you haven't traded anything for it yet. Deep says. Scoot in the boot. Gotta scoot that boot. 
Okay, so I think he just he goes that way if he sees you. Like, if you're in line of sight. I think you can clip him on the corners. Like, just kind of assume that he can see behind him for a moment. So it's just a matter of doing this until you're, like, lined up with him. Oh, come on, that's three hits. Rule of three. I mean, you don't go down in three hits. Why does it count for the enemies? Everybody dies in three hits. That's, that's the rule. I mean, I can stop a bullet once, not three times. I don't know where that came from. There's four. Okay, so secondary to rule of three is rule of five. Really? <laughs> okay, no. du okay, you double the rule of three, rule of six, but typically there's a pattern change or something on three, so it's two rules of three. <sighs> really? You're just not even... I don't know, I always remember this guy being annoying. Seven. So what's it gonna be, nine? Three rules of three? It's gonna end on eight and a half. Dang it. But how does that even work? Eight. I mean, the dude's already suffered, like, concussions to keep running nine. the wall. Not nine. Ten? Ten's a nice round number. We're beyond rule of three at this point. Gonna be ten. Gonna be a nice round number. Wow, I hit him. Ten. Nice round number. I think ten was maybe a few too many. I'm gonna look him up. Maybe just a few. I'm gonna look him up, see how you're supposed to be, quote-unquote, supposed to beat him. Okay, not a ton going on in here, just... Oh, his name's Q-Ball? That's silly. Thanks, piece of power, I've got a goo ball on me now. Okay, here's something we could have done, and I'm pretty sure everyone's gonna say something about it, but apparently you can just jump over him with the rocks and feathers. Oh, well, heck. I... I feel like that's a thing that you can do that's super jank. Uh, I think and not intended. I think this is the super jank one, but it's the uh, you stand it. Yeah, we can swim. Stand near one of the corners of the room, so you're facing an area where cue ball has to change direction before he gets the chain the chance to change the way he's moving. Slash him at the side of its body, and you'll deliver a blow. It feels like a speed running tactic. It kind of does. Oh, I may have just been able to do it. I may have just been able to do it before. That other one? Nah, I don't think you did. No, I think I could have. I have doubts because I'm doubting. Doubt, doubt, doubt. Doubt, doubt, doubt. Doubt. Okay, so I can go to the right here. Not that that does much for me. I don't have a key, so I can't go there. I mean, I can go there, I just don't have a key. I might as well go in and make sure that, like, I don't need a key, otherwise I'm going to be real embarrassed. Oh, I can go back and open this chest, and I can go down there. So two things to do, and there's this room here. And a staircase. Hey. 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 Don't make me hey. even buy a set of bow and arrows. Ugh. I don't know if I can get up the full boost in, like, one tile. Nah, you don't. You can't do it in one tile. I told you. Why didn't you believe me? If they gave me two tiles, I could have done it. Yeah, that's why they didn't give you two tiles. Who would give you two tiles? Oh, hey. 
More stairs. Some kind of thing that thwomps to the ground. Tip tap, tip tap, tip tap, tip tap. I did that somehow. Magic, maybe? Got the nightmare key. Go buy, go beat up a boss. You know, watch. This is supposed to be like the super easy boss, and I'm gonna get my butt kicked. <laughs> I mean, knowing anyone's luck, that's how it usually happens. Okay, I have a go underwater button. Do I have a? I do have a stroke button. Stroke. And I do need a key. Stroke. Stroke. I mean, you can stop saying that. No, I'm having a stroke. <laughs> yeah, I do have a stroke button. <gasps> Oh god. Barry, he's dying. Can I have the channel? Best friend. Okay, so I can't go down there without a key, so I need a key. Best friend's dying, just ask if I can have the channel. <laughs> be there, be there. So we got this and this. I think that's the only two things left for us, so let's go check that out. You know, the greatest part would be that she'd walk in and go like, no, the channel's mine, I've waited for this. <laughs> it's Animal Crossing forever now. Like, the funny thing is, all having a YouTube channel really does is give you access to the current group of like, followers. <laughs> Otherwise, taking the channel doesn't give you anything that starting a new channel wouldn't do. I mean, also the fact that, like, everyone can just unsubscribe easily enough. And yeah. foil any plan you have on that one. Yeah. I don't know there's Hi. any nefarious plans or anything for that. Well, at least it left me over here. Yay! I got here before this pea hat lands on me. I got money I can use to buy bows and arrows now. Okay, I think that is actually everything, and we even have a small key so I can go do that. That will probably just take us there so we can go fight a boss. Probably. Okay, nice and easy. I was debating, like, is it going to be easier just to go back here and warp up here and then go that way? Just so I don't have to jump this thing. Do a flip. Okay, I made it. We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay, so it's down here and... I'm gonna take that heart now. Oh, fish. Yeah, look at these fish. I they totally don't look like any other fish I've ever seen. Yeah, very rotund looking fish. You can slash down. And up. Oh, I, ha I had tried that and he didn't. I guess I... So I assumed from there immediately that he never could, but I guess I just didn't hold down far enough. You know what assuming does? It means you took a guess. I mean, come on. You can only be right so many times. Yeah. Sometimes you have to be wrong. That's kind, of, that's kind of a funny thing where... Sometimes you have to be wrong and learn your lesson from the whole thing. It's just how it goes in life. Now that's a funny thing that you'll, see in, that you'll see in videos and things where for a really long time someone will be like... Well, someone will not be using a relatively easy mechanic, such as there, slashing up or down underwater. Stop talking and go in and search Sabin. And quickly. Okay, fine. Like, everybody watching that will just be like, you know you can do that, right? Why didn't you ever think to do that? And the answer is usually, I tried, and it 
just so happened that one time that I tried it, it didn't quite work out right. I'm gonna be honest with you. I remember a Simpsons bit that was just exactly like a moment like that. And it was... Maggie was stuck in, stuck in the bathroom. And... Sure is an anglerfish. They tried diff different various methods to get her out. Like, one of the first ones they did was, like, use a wire hanger to try to unlock the lock, because she'd been locked in. Mm. And then they tried, ever, like, the various different things afterwards, and then Lisa just unlocks it again with the wire hanger. And she goes like, I don't know why we always give up on the first thing we try and not, don't try it again. I just always have this moment of, like, maybe I should try it again just to be certain. Like maybe yeah, because you'll get stuff like there where, yeah, I tried, but like I guess I didn't aim down far enough, so my assumption was, okay, I tried and it didn't work, so there's no reason for me to like keep trying. Like you just can't do it. Also, knock. I'm gonna need you to turn in your gamer badge and gun because you took damage on the angler boss, so you're not a I know, gamer anymore. I'm sorry. Do you know how hard I would hit somebody in the face with my tablet if they said shit to me like that and to my face? Like, seriously? It's just like, you're not a real gamer, you took damage on the t uh, angler boss, I'd be like, WHAM! <laughs> now, sir, you want to explain why you assaulted the man? Yeah, he told me I wasn't a gamer, a true gamer, but took damage on an easy boss. The death penalty for him. Get my heart. I remember a, like, ogre battle, Super NES. There was a guide I followed that was like, the first boss in the game is literally just like, you should win it on turn, like, your first attempt to fight him. Mm. And it's, it's like the guide said, and if you don't, just turn off the game, you're not even gonna make it, it's not even worth it. And I remember my units didn't take him out the first time, and I was like, I'm just gonna keep playing. Like, well, guess I should never play this game that I'm enjoying and interested in. Like because I'm, I didn't beat the first boss in one round. I'm pretty sure it was sarcastic, but we're talking like early 2000s internet, you never know. Yeah. Bay. Michael kind of Bay. bay. Yeah, what kind of Bay? Michael oh, Bay? Oh god, it's gonna be overpriced, but somehow kind of interesting to look at in that kind of like train wreckage way where you're like, I can't look away, but I'm still kind of interested. It's, it's really hard to tell. Yeah, it's gonna like objectively not be amazing, but still fun. And then I'm gonna make a career out of it on YouTube. Hi. I sure do. I don't like that sound he made. That was super awkward for me. <laughs> I know, I was over here, like, trilling my finger and moving my feet to the beat. Uh, um, so, again, because we're recording remotely, we've got to go through some hoops in order to be able to do it. So I'm actually hearing all audio twice, once at a slight delay. So, like, that was real weird. Oh, so now we can just warp whenever. I think it's a little more I think, complicated I think that's what he said. That. I know if you're in dungeons, it warps you back to the front of the dungeon. Yeah, but, like, we don't have to go find a warp point. The front of the dungeon, the entrance. 
Why is there nothing over here? Oh, crap, there is something over here. Oh, waterfall. God, I have not been swimming in ages. I'd like to go swimming, but there's the current thing happening that kind of... I'm, I'm not going to be that stupid about it. Yeah. Also, I'm going to be honest. If you have, like, way more people in a pool than you can't swim in, it ain't no point going swimming. Yeah. Like, you have to have, like... As... <laughs> Like, if you can't friggin' move, yeah, if, you can't, if you can't really swim, you can't then lay, why swim? If you can't, like, lay on your back or anything, it ain't no fun to swim. Ooh, piece of heart. Yay. How many are you up to? I have no idea. Uh, that might... 103. No, I think Three. third, yeah. I just remembered it earlier in the video. There's 100 off. Your, your Matt Light thing, where he accidentally said he was like level 700 or something. <laughs> okay, so I've already been over here. So I can go see what's over that way. And that's probably gonna do me. I just wanna see what's over here real quick. Maybe a dead end. Probably a dead end. It is a dead end. You said, you said dead end so weird there, it sounded like Den Den, I was like, Den Den? Den Den. One of them Dens. Den Den. Now, so now, okay, now, so. Now it sounds like you're, now it sounds to me like you said Den, Dead, Dend. So I'm like, it's Den, but what's Dend? Because it's just Den with a D at, at the end, but you pronounce the D. Okay, so I'm guessing we're going down here next, because that's where the water current takes me. Yeah, it's funny how you were, like, a dungeon earlier, where you're like, I have to go to the bay, and it's like, no, you're drowned in the bay. You don't even have the flippers yet. Home slide. Well, that's where it was pointing me. I mean... They just wanted me to cross over to the other side of the bay. I mean, the finger... To was... get something, so I could go do another dungeon. The finger was pointing all the way up, and you were like, That's it! South! And it's like, no! Stop it, Zoro. You dumb dumb. Look, I can't see your hand from here. Uh, I can't see your hand from here. Okay, so, um... Until next time, everyone! I don't know what we're gonna do. Maybe we're gonna do that. You said there's another dungeon open. Maybe I'll go look at that. We have options. Maybe I'll just murder everything. It doesn't matter. Maybe I'll just murder everything. It's a video game. Nothing ever matters. I like the little bubbles that come out like I'm playing it underwater. Oh, cool. Oh, this makes it way easier. Hey, we could just do this now. I still feel like we need another warp point like over here. Yeah. I mean, I guess you go to, like, the one in the middle. Yeah, like, you go to this one and go yeah. left, but, like, that's a hall. And you're kind of out in the wilderness. I could have sworn there was something, like, right there, didn't I? Hmm. I'm spinning! <laughs> Hold up. I actually want to go check something real quick. Cool. Heck! It's a g g g g g ghost. Do you like? Nah, he's okay, well, he's just gonna follow me around, I guess. I got a new friend. I mean, you're not as good as Bow Wow, but I mean, we'll see how it goes. Oh, yeah. Whoa, 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 bow and arrow. See how much you get for a bow and arrow now. I don't know if you got the amount you need. Maybe. You're, it was like 980? Yeah, 9, Dang! Yeah, oh, you're 10 off. Ah! Oh. That's it, I'm stealing this old man. And I'm keeping the 9. taking my money! I'm gonna be so broke. Oh, Naga, you're really needing money for much else in this game. Done! Not done. Done! I mean, it really depends on how much you want to be a complorsionist, so... And now I walk out with it. Is that a ghost following you? We don't serve ghosts. Get out of here. Don't worry about but, it. But I want to buy the bow and arrow. I said get out of here. 
Look at this guy's face, though. That is the face of someone who is ripping you off. Oh boy, this shirt is expensive. It's literally, sure is, buddy. It's literally what I said. He's like the embodiment of that line from the original uh, Legend of Zelda. Just, boy, this sure is expensive. Okay, so I wanted to go check real quick. Because I don't know if I ever went back for it. And I just happened to see it in the forest. Oh, is it that one cave? This rock right here. Oh. Ow! Yay! It's a secret. Okay, that's show. it. Until next time, everybody. We have a couple options. We'll see what we do.